one owner car guy, oneownercarguy.com, is clearing out around here. I'm getting a lot of cars gone. And these videos here, I've got two videos I'm doing that are like a daily vlog video, but they're a combination of kind of little excerpts and blips and stuff I filmed. And I'm trying to change the way I'm doing the vlogs and the way I'm doing videos, and I'm caught up here more. And this is a kind of a hodgepodge of vlogs type stuff. Um, picking up cars and going to auctions and all kinds of stuff in them. Um, so check it out. You'll enjoy, I hope. Right here. Straight in. No leaks or anything really bad. There's a little leak over there. We'll see how this bad boy does. It just it, it, once you're once you're driving, the steering feels okay. But when it's not car, like it feels, it feels like there's like bad steering. You know? You probably don't have power steering. Oh, <laughs> that's what I meant. Yeah, it probably doesn't have any. Open it up. Let's look. I forgot about that. And that's what I was gonna tell you too. To where you know, but on something like this, sometimes you'll flood it if you pump it too much. But sometimes in the morning, you gotta pump it a couple times. Sit over there. TV joint or something or a steering joint, that blue, that black belt on it or a black boot, it's all split. That's bad. I'll have to just close that. But you can sell it quick. You can it. No, there's no power steering on this car. And you don't need it either once you start going. Okay. Yeah, and you'll get extra power. Think about this, when you turn your AC off, you get like three more miles a gallon. I didn't even have it on. Well I'm saying on any car. Oh. Sure. But like that's one less pulley if you don't have a power steering pulley either. That's two pulleys you don't have. It's but this has AC. Spunk. It has spunk when I barely... Oh, I don't, Dad. It's a nice little motor. At least you don't know when you're driving it, you're going to figure out if it's going to be driving. Yeah. How do, you, how do you know that stuff? Just the way it feels? Because every car's different, right? Lifetime of replacing it. No? Like that CV joint, I'm going to feel that the minute. I don't know if it's steering or CV. If you're looking for that water or the gas in this thing? I don't see no gas pumping into it. No, I don't either. But it's running, so it's sucking it up from the bottom and pumping it out through the top in the middle. Something to that effect, and they're leaving it in there to filter it or something. So, when I smack on the bottom of that tank, though, there was hardly nothing in it. I guess we'll just pull up behind that, hop in, and hop in over there, and we'll go to my other car. Oh, no handle. No handle. How much are those? eBay, probably like five to fifteen yes. bucks. Cause some black guy walked by and he's like, "Yeah, that's all original, right?" Like you could tell, like, like he knew that there was some good in it. You know, he wasn't just like that piece of shit. You know, he was like, "I was surprised what he said." It's not as bad as I thought. It is not as bad as I thought. We'll have to think about that. See all this old. I think all that'll clean up a little. Oh bit. yeah, we can put some water, <laughs> some soapy water. It's my rad racer. And oh, and the guy who's doing the gasoline actually said they had two of these in the family, and he said one went to 560,000 miles. Wow. And I was like, what? Really? He's like, yep. And we had one a wagon like this, and he said we had the sedan one too. See, and that's usually what it is with a lot of these guys. Is they're just running around, and everybody's calling them other places, and they're just like stressed out. Yeah. But like, they're usually pretty cool once you got their attention. Mm -hmm. But on auction day, some auctions don't even let you pick up until the auction's over. Okay, we have no way to know if I'm getting hot. So, because I've got no, I don't believe I've got a heat gauge. So, um. Well, that's not going to work. Yeah. What should we put in the car so you could make sure it doesn't overheat? We got coolant, extra coolant? No, it's full. It's just, I don't know. Keep your eye behind if you see. Your phone charge? My probably phone's enough. 40% too, so I'm. You got enough then? Here's this thing. You, I got 35%. I, I left this charging when I left, so. Oh, you have it a should be charger, good. Huh? It's tiny, but it does something. I'll pull up the GPS see where it which, which. Well, I'm just going down this road. Oh, I got you. In three blocks, there's a gas station on the right. Oh, That's okay. where I'm going. I, the only place I'll lose you is right here in this mess. You're already ready? Yeah. You are too, right? Uh, yeah. Just be safe. Okay, I wish I would have got my other stuff already, but I didn't. So, yeah. 
Where am I going? I'm going to Capriati's. First freeway drive of the Nissan. Seems to be doing pretty good. Alec is back there somewhere. We gotta close this gap. Man, we are clipping down the road. This thing is driving just as nice as can be. I wonder how cool you are in this little car. Coming up beside a semi. Sometimes a sober experience. Yeah, beautiful scenery. These lanes get small. I can almost go right under there. This is the best part. I couldn't get my Google Glass out of the seat fast enough. I'm in my little Nissan Sentra, and I was, well, it's a gas in 210. Nissan Sentra cusp. And I was screwing with this guy, revving on him. Having some fun. Having some fun. Yes, sir. No more of that. He didn't like it too much either when I took off on him and got ahead of him. Guy, OneOwnerCarGuy.com is pouring. I got some bags and a blanket got new inventory got this here e320 in and actually i'm trying to pull off a little bit of a feat today it's pouring here and it's gonna be pouring here tomorrow it's not raining in simi valley and i've got a nissan up there that's next in line really and this thing is beautiful but i don't have it washed so i'm gonna try and do something here this is stupid, but it's my work truck. It's my new work truck. That's right. That's where we're going with this. Unless... That's such a fun car to drive. Yeah, buddy. Shifts good, drives good, steers good, nice car. That's a very nice time of day. Not a lot of people here. We just did 46 minutes. Oh, it laughed at me. Ha ha, 46? That's right, I'm gonna count every one. Hey! Wait a sec! Okay! <laughs> I'll be out of breath by the time I get here. How you doing? Good, how you been? I think I'm gonna take it off the dolly first. Cool. There's no coils on the back anymore. Cool. Oh. That's that's cool. Yeah, that does make it a little better. Did you get a new one and sold it or what? Yeah, this one's going to my son. It's time for them to get hand me downs, is what I got all my life. My mom was <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Hey, that worked. Hi. Thank you. I didn't Harry. think I was going to be much. Well, I seen and I was like, hey, wait, I think they're putting that in there. And then I was like, oh, they're folding the seats down. No, 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 no. Hang on. <laughs> we're going we're gonna to attempt to put it in there. Just scream at, <laughs> scream at me if you need something like this. I don't give a shit. I yeah. need it. So like, don't be doing that. Let me know. Scream at me. I'm right there. If you got something like that, let me know. Cool. Hey, W124 is everywhere, baby. Okay, so there's an Uber driver around here. And when you order Uber Eats, and you don't get your ass to the curb in like, you got five minutes. And when somebody's nice and waits around 10 minutes and calls you about four or five times and tries to get a hold of you, that's one thing. But when you don't come out then, guess who, where the food goes? You don't go back to the restaurant and the person already paid. Three people here have already had food 
and there's still enough people or food for three or four more people. All kinds of stuff. It's amazing what we see come home on this type of thing from like Uber Eats. And it's just free food that somebody didn't eat. One on a car guy, one on a car guy.com. Backyard's done. I'm looking good now. The grass, all the rocks in, all the gravel's in. Fence needs some work. But for that much, it's all done. And I'm gonna bring some cars in here, get some stuff moved around. Beautiful E320. Beautiful E320 wagon. Both nice cars. This one might be sold to my friend Marcus. You might know him on my channel. He's been here a few times and he's actually bought quite a few cars from me. Good guy. And not just because he's bought quite a few cars with me, because he's a friend. He's somebody I've met on here on YouTube and have actually gotten to know really well over the last years. And it's kind of funny, he's been here, I think four times. This is the oddest car. It starts in neutral. Doesn't like starting at anything else though. That's okay. Some kind of selector switch type thing. Now I think, I'm thinking I can make it to the store with this for returns. We shall see, because I think I'm going to try it. Well, this might tell me right here. Huh? I like it. I think this might make it. So I got this one full of returns. Roxy dog! I got that one full of trash. Is it gonna make it? Oh man, talk about just barely. <laughs> I planned that. Yes, I did, I planned that. Perfect parking for two and a trampoline. I mean, you can't beat the way this is. Hi, Roxy. Hi, Roxy. I think that'll do it. I got a guy here I'm buying a dryer from. How you doing? Good God. <laughs> cool. Cool. Let's see. What are you doing? I'm just yanking this sucker out, but I know I'm hooked up, so I was gonna shut it off and. Am I gonna head back? I got a baby in there. Go for it then. Go for it then. All right. That one's broke, huh? Huh? Your yeah, roommate will help you, bro. I appreciate it, though. Thank you. Have a great, have a great day. day. Okay. So I've actually had to take it through the house because it's either that or take off the doors. And I didn't want to take off the doors. Huh. Hi, baby girl. Well, it ain't quiet. It ain't pretty, but it's drying. I'm going to get some stuff done right now. Um, I've actually got the power washer loaded in there. I got this charging.
go. Could have been fine before. And with his my alarm. You open out, girl. Well, he might not want to help him with the dog. Couldn't do it without her, right? Okay. Well, come on, man. This thing's gonna get old pretty fast. Isn't it, Roxy? <coughs> I think the boop boop is off. See, but then it's totally dead. Let's try one more time. No way, that was just... That wasn't even putting out two amps. Actually, should I? I should probably replace that before I sell it just because it'll look better. I had somebody comment on the video that it looked like a Mercedes diesel battery. It does. It kind of does. Okay, let's do this. Door handle, that's right. See ya. And that's how you make a work truck out of a, a Mercedes. Actually doing some meatloaf stuff before I head out. And just really started on that. What's going on, man? Not much, man. How you doing? Good. Today's the day I heard. Supposedly, but it's gonna happen. Really? Yeah. Exciting times. Yeah. No more no sleep or anything? That sounds great. <laughs> I thought, man, that was quick, and I thought, wow, they probably thought it hasn't been so quick. <laughs> and, I mean, I didn't feel anything. <laughs> it's true. One owner car guy, oneownercarguy.com, and I got a detailing video here for you today. Cool stuff, cool detailing, fun stuff. Well, that was it. Thanks for watching. Make sure and subscribe. Daily videos every day. That's what that means. Thanks for watching. We'll talk to you.